Hi friends, Misha Crossing here with a new Dreamtown video. Uh, today we are dreaming of the sleepy town called Wilt. This town is by Tumblr user Pigeon Coffee. Her name is Abigail or Abby. I don't really know exactly what she prefers to be called, but oh my god, I love it already. I think... I think I've visited this town before, but it's been quite some time. Um, I really don't remember the plaza looking this way, so maybe she's updated it since I last visited. Oh, the overall dress, bandage, green striped socks, and hiking boots. Oh, this is gonna be a cute outfit. What's in here? Oh, birthday cake! Thank you! My birthday is actually coming up in the next couple of weeks, so thank you for my cake. <laughs> oh, these socks are gonna be adorable. Do you even see the socks? I actually can't tell. Hold on. Remove socks. My cat is screaming at me. Yeah, you can see the top of the socks. Cute. Oh, let me, uh, is there a hat somewhere? That's a sparkler. That's coffee. And beans. Okay, I'll pick all these things up, but it doesn't look like I have a hat just yet, but maybe there's one laying around. Oh, hello. My, my kitty is jumping up here as as per usual, whenever I'm filming a video, she likes to be up where the action is. Okay, I got her situated in my lap. Now let's walk around town. Okay, I don't even, hmm. Guess I'll go to the right first. God, look at all that open space to the left. <laughs> I can't wait to see all that. Oh, the windmill here. Okay, no, I'm putting my, my cat down. She is being a bother. Okay. Oh, wow, this is kind of similar to how I was thinking um, oh what a pretty town flag to how I was thinking Kodama would be laid out with the black and white flowers and some mushrooms I'm probably not going to have as many clovers because I'm not hacking them but I love it oh this is so nice she doesn't have as many trees as I have though I kind of went a little, <laughs> little heavy on the trees Oh, the torch. Very nice. I love the bus stop. So peaceful. Let me get something out. Let me get some... I'll have some coffee. <laughs> this lamppost. Oh my gosh, it is one of my favorite things. It makes the town look just so... I don't know, just more natural and, and overgrown and old, I feel like. Because it's not like, you know, modern um, technology. I also love the statue fountain, another huge favorite. On the campsite here, it's tucked away by this pond. Oh, I like that a lot. It's down here. Oh, the log bench. Perfect. These two cedar trees in front of it. Ah, so cute. Oh, let me see what um, <clears throat> all villagers she has. This is Poppy, Marcel, Teddy. Oh, I love Teddy. Eric, I love Eric, Biscuit, Benjamin, Nate, Rudy, and Cole. Oh, she's got a lot of cuties. I've said it before and I'll say it again. Teddy has one of my favorite houses. Let me go up and see. Whose house was this up here? Marcel. Oh, he has a really nice house as well. Fits right in with the very overgrown foresty theme. Whoopsie daisy, wrong way. All right, down across this bridge. Oh, here's Teddy. Let's say hi. What? Now here's a face we don't see around here very often. We'll take your time and check out the town. It's fun, Groof. Thanks, Teddy. All right, we got a little layout of houses down here. There's Eric's house. That's is that that's not Benjamin. Is that Benjamin? I don't remember what Benjamin looks like. Maybe it is Benjamin. Yep, it is. Okay. Oh, and am I already dreaming? How did I get here? <laughs> Oh, she's got another lamppost down here that looks so perfect. Mixed with all these houses. And there's another lamppost up here. And then, oh, there is a house on the beach. What? I just noticed that. <laughs> and I can't get to that beach without swimming to it. So hopefully there is a... Marco, stop eating that plant. It's a... Uh, uh, a peace lily too and it's not good for her but for some reason she likes to try to eat it <laughs> um, here's another little tiki torch here 
Uh, the waterfall. Oh, and there's the uh, <gasps> yellow flowers. Uh-oh. I bet those weren't meant to be there. <laughs> um, oh, what's this called? The Zen... It's not an oasis. I can never remember what that's called for some reason. Oh, this looks so nice. All right, but there is a house up here for us to go visit. I remember, uh, I do remember her interiors. I remember loving the interiors. So I am excited to see them. I like this exterior too. It looks very nice. Nestled into a forest. Oh, yep. Oh, I love it. <laughs> It's so perfect. Just the kind of uh, house you'd expect to be in the middle of a forest. Got a nice cozy fireplace here. Vintage telescope. I love this classic bookcase customized to that dark color. Yeah, this looks so great. Oh, I need to... <laughs> in order to get over here, I gotta go through here. There we go. Let's see what's in this room. It looks like a little kitchen. Yeah, kitchen. I was unsure until I saw the stew pots, but this is definitely a little kitchen. Got the uh, clay oven, clay furnace, whatever it's called. A couple stew pots. Another fireplace, which is perfect. And I love this kotatsu with the, the plaid design on it. Oh, it's so nice. Then it looked like there was... Oh, gotta go back around. <laughs> um, another room over here. Looks like she might have all the rooms except for the back room, possibly. Ooh, a little library. Oh, I love that. Got this couch here where you can sit and be super comfy and read a book. So many books behind you to choose from. Oh, yeah. Man, I love this house. <laughs> Good job. <sighs> Are there more rooms, please? Yay, there's an upstairs and a downstairs. <laughs> I want this house to go on forever. Oh, the nice mossy carpet down here. Kind of like an outdoor spa type area. Lots of, mm -hmm. lots of plants. Mm -hmm. Some sculptures. Little spa tub here. Mm -hmm. So, so nice. I just love the feel of this house. It's very serene um, and natural and plant filled, but also very, very cozy and welcoming. I like it a lot. Margo's now sitting on the desk by my microphone, just staring at me, <laughs> wondering why she cannot eat her plant or get in my lap. <laughs> oh, and oh, this harp is so nice. Can I interact with it? Oh, I can! It sounds like a piano. But a little different. <laughs> Got more bookcases and the telescope. A little bed in front of the window with some coffee by it. Oh, I love it. Good job, Abigail. 10 out of 10. Oh, I'm excited to see the rest of the town. I'm excited to get to that house on the beach, too. I'm determined. Gonna find a way. Oh, look, here's our little mayor. Let's talk to her. Oh, it's Abigail. Farewell, Wilt. What? Farewell. Oh, I think she uh, uh, deleted Wilt to make a new town. So just the dream address is here for us. All right, over this bridge is the cafe. Nestled into the trees. Very pretty. I love how these paths are just so, so wide and open. My paths in my town are like very, like they're just surrounded by trees, very narrow. <laughs> but this still feels super like foresty and overgrown just with really, you know, wide open spaces. I want a lighthouse here, keeping watch on the ocean. Got some more villager houses down here. So nice. Oh, another statue fountain. Love it. This is like all of my favorite public works projects. <laughs> oh, and got some of the illuminated stuff. I guess if you stick around in the dream town for long enough, the sun will set and these will come on. That's really awesome. 
Man, I think I want to go down to the beach and see if I can get to that house over there. The log bench right here. Okay, it's the ramp. The ramp's right here. <clears throat> Maybe the... Um, 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 um. Oh no, the wetsuit is not right here. <laughs> oh dear. So it's going to be hidden somewhere around town, I guess. Hopefully I can find it. If not, I will have to yell at Abby, message her on Tumblr, and tell her to tell me where the wetsuit is. <laughs> Okay, so on up here. This is gonna be the big open space. Oh man, I just don't even know where to go. I just love this. It's so open. So many trees. I love the Stonehenge. It's a great little area. What's this? What's buried underneath this stump here? I need to know. Oh, but I don't have a shovel, so I can't know. Mm. Oh well. <laughs> There's another statue fountain in front of retail. That looks so nice. And of course, retail's pond. Oh, with the stone hinge right by it. And the Zen uh, train station. Cool. Go back down this way. Oh, she's got a little, uh, town map on a custom design sign. I'm just having fun being, being quiet and taking it all in. Oh, yay, look! Everything's illuminated now. <laughs> we stuck around for just a couple minutes. And they came on. Beautiful. Oh, here's another illuminated tree here. Let's see what's up here. Oh, the Zen Garden. That's so nice. Right by the river. Okay. What all? Oh, here's the police station. Oh, look, she moved the, uh, um, what's it called? The message board over here. That looks really nice. Really great. Okay, I'm going to look around here and see if, uh, I missed the wetsuit sitting out here, maybe? I don't think so. Hmm. Okay, let me try looking. Maybe it is buried over there. <laughs> let me get a shovel from. Is it Lloyd that's in the dream town? Yeah. So, yeah, let me borrow a shovel, please. Thank you, Lloyd. Maybe it's- if it's not buried in front of that stump, I actually- I think I will go message her on Tumblr and see if I can find it. Or see if she can tell me where it is. If she happens to be online. Oh, but where was that stump? Here it is. I bet it's just gonna be like a, um, fossil or- or something. Yep, it's a fossil. <laughs> Darn. Okay, well, yeah, I'm going to go message her and see if I can figure out where the wetsuit is so I can get to that house on the beach. I will. I'll be right back. Friends, good news. I'm on the beach. So I didn't find the wetsuit. I messaged both Abby, um, who's the owner of this town, and then Amy, who is fate side on Tumblr that I know she's good friends with to see if she knew where the wetsuit was. Um... And Amy says she thinks she forgot to put it out before she updated, which is hilarious, but, um... I sat on the- I looked to see if there was a way to glitch down onto the beach since I knew her town was hacked and lo and behold there was this little stump right here um, that I sat on and turned forward and was able to jump and glitch down onto the beach so we're here! Um, so it looks like she has a little character down here on the beach in a, oh, a little wetsuit um, 
Don't disturb the insects. Oh, okay. I'll try not to. Um, with a little uh, tent house, which is really, really cute. Where's my cursor? There it is. Okay. Sorry, I thought the cursor might have been on my screen. Oh, this is adorable. I'm so glad I was able to glitch down here so I could see this. Got the little veggie basket. Got some insects. Couple, let's see, a, probably a cricket and a mole cricket. I would say, and then a little grasshopper over there. Oh, this is awesome. Oh, and I can turn the radio on. Perfect. Oh, this is so cute. Okay, I'm so glad I was able to get down here. That's really funny that she forgot to put the uh, the wetsuit out because she... Oops, excuse me, friend. Oh, what was this character's name? Oh, Sunny. Aww. So maybe Sunny um, researches insects or just likes to collect insects. <laughs> um, oh, goodness. Now I don't have a way back up. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> So I'm not going to be able to, uh, I'll just have to turn off the game. Um, oh my god. <laughs> Abby just messaged me. She forgot to put it out before she updated, well, or before she deleted it. <laughs> That's hilarious. Um, so just FYI, if you visit Wilt, come and sit on this stump and you can glitch down. Um, you will just have to power off your game in order to exit Wilt since you won't be able to get back up. Um... Oh, but I love this dream town so much. I'm so glad I got to visit it and see everything. I'm really glad she uh, um, updated it for the, you know, Welcome Amiibo update before she restarted her town. Because this is adorable. Town goals for sure. All right. Well, thank you all so much for watching. Oh, there's Eric up there. Um, I hope you all enjoyed watching this. Sorry, it got a little messy towards the end trying to get down here. Um, but I will be up tomorrow with a new episode of my Let's Play series in my town, Kodama. So be sure to check that out if you want to and follow my other social media. Uh, links are in the description box if you want to follow those. You'll have a wonderful day. Be kind to one another and don't forget to be awesome. Bye.